Hello everyone. The weather in Melbourne is famously changeable. Melbournians experience all four seasons in a year. Lately, the sky has been gloomy with nights falling earlier than usual. And there's a sprinkle of rain now and then. These changes signal the start of winter. No matter if it's raining, gloomy, sunny or whatever changes, we have to go to work. I usually travel to work by train. If working in the city, the most convenient way of transport is by train. This rechargeable smart card is called Mikey, used for public transport in Victoria. Cards can be recharged using machines at train stations or over custom service counters. Simply touching on and touching off the card will automatically deduct the fare for travel. Trains are usually crowded during peak hours. However, it's still easier to use trains to commute to Melbourne City for work than driving as roads are also busy and traffic jams can waste time. One thing I appreciate when navigating Melbourne's train stations is the courtesy shown on escalators. Those not in a hurry often move to one side, allowing others to walk up or down freely. These orange seats on trains signify priority seatings for those in need while the blue seats are for general passengers. Recently, nights have been arriving earlier and it's a bit darker when I get off at the station near my home. But every day, watching the sky's colors at sunset brings me a sense of calm and peace. I really love seeing this colorful evening sky. I wonder why the sky has these purple and blue hues. Even though the train journey to work isn't always my favorite, I absolutely adore the stunning view right behind my workstation. It's like having a little slice of beauty within arm's reach. And another thing I cherish about my job is this fun and supportive team. Check out what I captured last week while on the job. Here are two cleaners fearlessly tackling the windows of a towering building. I managed to film this from the 12th floor. Regular cleaning like this is what keeps Melbourne looking pristine, even with its countless skyscrapers. It's certainly not a job for the faint-hearted, especially for those who are afraid of hates. This scene of cleaning isn't new to me, as I often witness these buildings being cleaned every few weeks. Alright everyone, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I'll see you in the next one soon. Until then, good luck with your work. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, share and support me. Thanks guys.